How's it going, everyone? Welcome back to Mnix Play Slay the Spire. We're now on the final level, the third floor. And it's looking pretty good, I think. We defeated the last boss relatively easily, and he gave us the Lizard's Tail, which essentially means we have one and a half lives um, for the next boss. I'm thinking we should try and fight as many elites as we can, just so we can pick up a few more relics. I'm feeling pretty powerful, but at the same time, I feel like we could be stronger. Um, if I take this route here, I get to fight three elites, but I'll only be able to rest, let's see, once. That doesn't seem very good. Now the other option is to take this route, fight two elites, I'll be able to rest three times but there isn't a shop I think I want to hit a shop eventually is there a shop anywhere here and here if I want to hit this shop I can fight this elite rest get another relic Oh, there's another shop here. Come here, fight another elite, rest. Maybe we'll just fight two elites, and that way we'll be able to rest a few more times. I, no, I'm not just looking to rest, I'm looking to boost my strength with the Gurya. Um, so that's really important as well. So you know what, let's start one of these, either is fine. Let's start here. Okay, so this guy, he gains strength every turn. So I would probably want to do as much damage to him as I can in turn 1, which is probably possible, especially with Offering. So that's going to give me a lot of energy. I'm going to get Panache. I'm going to get Seeing Red, so that's a lot more energy. Double Tap. I am going to dual wield my Clash. So now I have 3 instances. Let's defend. Um, so my two next two attacks are double. So let's clash. And we got him. Easy. So easy. I have three potions that I... Hmm. I probably want to get rid of the elixir potion. The swift potion is too good. For card draw, definitely want that. Feel no pain. Whenever whenever a card is exhausted, gain 4 block. I do have quite a bit of exhaust on my deck, but I don't want to blow up the deck if I don't have to. It's a power though. Let's get it. I don't know. Maybe it's okay? I don't have... My, my deck is pretty thin right now. 29 cards. That's pretty okay. Okay, not too much damage this turn. Let's see. Let's use Finesse, game block, draw a card. Um, they are vulnerable, so let's drop kick. Um, hmm. Let's drop kick this guy. Whenever a card is exhausted, gain one block. Let's pick that up. I'm gonna headbutt uh, this exploder as well. And then I'll get drop kick back. I'm going to shrug it off for one more card draw, and then I'll get another drop kick, and another... Hmm. And I guess I'll just end with Metallicize, get myself a little bit more armor, and end my turn. I gotta kill these two as soon as I can, because they're gonna buff themselves, and when they die, they're gonna deal a lot of damage to me. So I don't want that. Okay, so in flame for strength. Uh, I suppose. Yeah, I don't have enough to kill him. I'll dual wield the strike. I'll defend once. And I'll strike this guy. Oh, that's not enough. Okay, whatever. I'll just take the damage, I guess. I'll take 10. 
That's not too bad. The thorns is getting kind of strong, though. That's a little annoying. Um, offering? Dark Embrace. Seeing red. So now whenever I exhaust, I deal extra... I, uh, I draw a card. Let's double tap. Oh god. Okay, definitely need to defend right now. Let's... Let's see. I can headbutt and bring some stuff back. But I don't know what I need. Let's just pommel strike. Shit, I don't know. Okay, Infernal Blade is good. I can bash this guy and then apply Vulnerable. If that's the case, I'll... Mm. A headbutt... I'll headbutt him. And I'll bring back Dropkick. No, I want Double Tap. And Dropkick. I don't have any card draw. Okay, I took a lot of damage this turn. I don't know if that's good. Uh, let's take a Sever Soul, maybe? No, I don't need it. I really don't. I don't need any more cards. Let's just skip. Skip all my rewards. I should try and use a uh, regen potion. Maybe next fight. Yeah, this isn't the best fight to use it, actually. Because... Oh, I can't use any potions anyways. There's no point. I can't drink potions. Okay. So let's finesse for a card draw. It's free anyways. Uh, there's no point in using Seeing Red because... We have enough energy, so just defend, defend. Every time you play three skills in a single turn, deal five damage to all enemies. And I guess I will hit... What are you? You're vulnerable? I'll hit you. These guys are doing a lot more damage than I thought they would. That's not good. I forgot that I can't use potions anymore, actually. Um, wow, they're doing a lot of damage. So shrug it off. Defend. Oh, headbutt. This guy. I'll bring back seeing red. I probably need it. And I'll also headbutt him again. And bring back finesse. No, shrug it off for some card draw. And let's leave it at that. Oh my god, I'm taking a lot of damage this turn. That's not good. That's really bad. Never mind fighting that elite enemy, right? Okay, so... Feel no pain. Oh shit, I should've dual, dual wielded it. Oh, that was a mistake! Seeing red, shrug it off. Let's dual wield in flame. Gain some extra strength. And I guess I'll play double tap. I mean, there's... Whatever. I'm gonna take two more damage this turn. But this guy is essentially dead. Okay. So I could... Pommel strike... You. Infernal blade. No one is vulnerable. Are you vulnerable? No, he just has reduced strength. Clash. Clash. Drop kick. Strike. And sword boomerang. Is that enough? Okay, that kills everybody. But I'm really low on HP now. At the end of your turn for each attack played this turn, deal one damage to all enemies. I don't need that. I think anger plus isn't that bad. Let's take that. I think I'm going to need to rest at the next place. 
Okay, this dude over here, I believe he debuffs me. So I should try and get rid of him first. Let's Dark Embrace. Infernal Blade. Okay, that's gonna give me card draw. Pummel. Deal 4 damage 4 times to this guy. 6 damage 4 times. Okay. Draw another card. Um, Cleave. I should use after I defend. In fact, no. I could exhaust my defend. Okay, okay. What's my discard pile? Finesse? Okay, 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 okay. So I will... Oh, look at this. So sick. I'm gonna play... Headbutt. I'll take three damage. I'll play second wind and I'll exhaust my defend. Which will give me a card draw. Well, this guy isn't dead? I, th I thought I had done it. I thought I was a genius. My math. Oh no. Oh, that's bad. That's not good. Okay, well, let's play Panache. Each time you play five cards in a single turn, deal ten, ten damage to all enemies. Let's disarm this guy here. Actually, let's play Anger on this guy. Let's kill him. And then let's disarm here, this guy. I'm dazed. I'm gonna defend. Ah, oh, I don't want to hit the Thorns guy. I need to. This needs to be a better way. I'm gonna hit that guy instead. Man, I need HP so bad. Okay, feel no pain. Offering. No, let's shrug it off first. What's in my discard pile? I'll headbutt this guy here. No, defend first. Headbutt. Let's put. Uh, second wind. I'll play Offering. Okay, I'll play Seeing Red. It's gonna give me more card draw. I'll play Inflame. It's gonna give me some strength. Is he vulnerable? He's not. So there's no point in drop kicking. So I'll just play Second Wind. Clothesline. Clash. Clash. Is there anything to add into my deck? I guess Shrug It Off is okay. I need more energy gain. Okay. Holy shit! <sighs> this looks kind of bad. Okay, we'll Shrug It Off first. Dark Embrace. And I'll drop kick this guy. Feel no pain. So I might take some damage this turn, but going forward, whenever I exhaust anything, I'm gonna get a lot of armor. So that's good, I think. But this is a lot of damage to take. So Panache is free. Metallicize. I have a lot of armor here. Shrug it off. Infernal Blade. Exhaust your hand. Deal 9 damage for each exhausted card. I don't know if that's... I don't know if that's the play. God, I don't want to use any more offerings, but I guess I kind of have to, huh? Finesse. Exhaust all non-attack cards. And gain 5 block for each. 
Let's headbutt this guy here. Let's bring back um, I don't have much energy. Finesse. I do want to cleave. Well, let's second win first. Finesse. Is this enough to kill them? Oh god. Barely. I guess I'll fiend fire this guy. I'm so close to killing them. Whatever, I have a ridiculous amount of armor now. I don't think he can do anything to me. Problem is... I don't have any armor either. Is there anything I can exhaust? No, I just have to take damage? You know what? I'm gonna wait a turn. Just so that hopefully I can gain some armor this turn and I won't take damage. Oh god, is this gonna work? Defend, seeing red, headbutt. Okay, so I blocked the thorns. I think that was a good move right there. At the start of each turn, gain two strength. I feel like this could work. Especially considering the fact that I'm basically just blocking every turn and then waiting it out. I need to rest. I don't have a choice right now. I wanted to uh, to lift, but I think we need to rest. So that takes us up to 51. Let's go to the shop. Maybe I can buy a nice relic. At the start of each combat, draw two additional cards. That is amazing. At the start of your turn, deal three enemies... Three damage to all enemies. That's that might not be great, especially if they have thorns. Whenever you rest, you may add a card to your deck. That's not great. Thinking ahead, draw two cards, then put a card from your hand on top of your draw pile. No, I don't need that. I need like either energy or free card draw. At the end of your turn, lose no. Let's take bag of preparation. I think having more cards at the start will really help. Um Gaining 7 block and exhausting a card might be okay, but you know what, let's get another finesse that could help. I should have removed the card actually, card removal service would have helped. Okay, so now... You know what, I think let's just take on one elite. Let's go to the camp and let's lift, gain one more strength, so that way I can do a little bit more damage. Get another relic, this is still good. Healing is 50% more effective during combat. So I heal... Uh, okay, so there's a lot of resting, actually. I heal 9 per combat. As you head upward, hopping from one floating shape to another, you slip, you begin to fall. While in free fall, you consider your options. Land safely with your greatest techniques. Channel a power to survive the fall. Strike at the wall to hang on to it. I'd rather lose a defend. Let's just land. Yo, that's actually good. That's actually really good. Okay, and then lift once more. So now we're at plus three strength. Really good. Okay, this guy has a lot of HP, right? I start with a lot of card draw. So let's take Panache. Let's take Finesse for more draw. Hell yeah. Demon form. Double tap. And then... I'll hit you twice for 15. And I'll hit you twice for 33. So 66 plus 15 damage. That's a lot of damage this turn. He's gonna debuff me. Wow. That's a lot of debuff. But I'm gaining a stupid amount of strength. So that's good. Um, 
Shrug it off. I don't want to lose HP. But I need defense, huh? Okay, well, I can apply one weak to you. So now at least you'll do 18 damage. I only have 6 block. Finesse. Shrug it off again. Infernal Blade. I'll clothesline you. Now I take 3 damage. Or I could play Offering. But that means I take 4 damage. No, let's end the turn. I'll just take 3. That's okay. It's not much, considering. Okay, so... Whenever a card is exhausted, gain 4 block. I'm gonna play Seeing Red. So gain more block. I don't, I don't need the block. Whatever, I'll add more strength, and then I'll end my turn. So he's gonna buff himself. But I am super buffed too. I have plus two, plus 12 damage. Is that enough to kill him? I don't think so. So you know what? I'm gonna dual wield Dark Embrace. Whenever a card is exhausted, gain one, right? He's not vulnerable. He's only weakened. I'm gonna take a lot of damage this turn. Holy crap. I'll headbutt him and I'll take... Um, I probably need second wind. I need more energy. I don't have enough. No, end my turn. Ow, 15 damage. But I'm not frail anymore. I'm gonna... Headbutt, and I can take back double tap. I disarm him, and I get to draw a card. I use double tap, and I get to pommel strike him twice. And hopefully, I get something good. I don't, but I might be able to kill him next turn. Is he dead? Bash. Pommel strike. We got him. I'm at 42 HP. It's not it's not great. Let's take a cleave plus. I'm I feel like we don't have enough attack cards in the deck. Oh man, do I even want to fight an elite? I think I'll be fine. Oh, I ended up in a shop. I don't need anything, or I don't have enough money for anything. Okay, I guess we just proceed. So we fight an elite. What is this? 500 HP. Panache. He's doing 13 damage to me this turn. Infernal Blade. Wait, what's this? For each card played this turn, Giant Head takes 10% more damage from attacks. Okay. Shrug it off for card draw. Metallicize for more block. I'll headbutt you. And I'll play Perfected Strike for free? No. I'll strike you, and then I'll play Perfected Strike for free, and I block his damage. That's good. Wait, he's counting down. <laughs> that doesn't sound good. Okay, I'll shrug it off. Inflame for more strength. I don't need seeing red. But I need to use it if I want to use Clash, I see. So Anger, Clash, Clash. 
He's taking a lot of damage. But that doesn't look that doesn't look good. What the hell is that countdown, man? So I'm gonna dual wield Dark Embrace. I'm gonna play it once. I'm gonna play finesse. I'm gonna play offering. I'm gonna play Dark Embrace again. Is that is that the right decision? I don't know anymore. I'll pummel strike you. Finesse. I'm gonna get a lot of card draw. Whether that's good or bad, I don't know. Shoot, he's down to two. I need to uh, I need to deal damage. Okay, okay, okay. So feel no pain. I'm gonna disarm you. Is he vulnerable? He's not vulnerable, so I'll just double tap and cleave you twice. And I guess I'll take a buttload of damage? Four damage. Is he dead? Please be dead. Bash. He's not dead. In fact, am I dead? Anger. Defend. I'm gonna take 20 damage. Holy shit. He's about to do 33. Uh, shrug it off. Okay, I have a clash. That's good. And he is vulnerable. Um, okay, let's just unload everything, right? Perfected strike. Strike. Clash. Anger. Am I dead? Oh, I'm dead. No, 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 I have the flower. Or I, I have the lizard's tail. I'm still okay. I'm still okay. And I get increased healing too. This, it's alright. Thank God I took that relic. Uh, finesse. I don't need demon form. I need dual wield. Dual wielding the cleave. Is that enough? Is he vulnerable? He's not vulnerable. Shrug it off. Cleave. Cleave. <sighs> okay. Raise your max HP by 14. Thank you. I need that. And uh, apply 5 weak and vulnerable to all enemies. Let's just take an Infernal Blade. That seems okay. Let's... Uh, I guess I don't need the rest. So let's just upgrade a card. I'm thinking... Oh god, I don't know. Offering seems okay. I need more energy. Where's uh, seeing red? That's already upgraded? Mmm, what do? Upgrading dual wheel doesn't seem like a bad idea. Pommel strike seems really good. You know what? Let's upgrade that. Alright, it's time. We either, we either win or we lose, right? 50-50. Okay. Let's start the turn with... A finesse. I don't even know how I do this. With a double tap. Let's start with double tap. We will... Drop kick this guy, and he is vulnerable. No, this guy. Okay. And now I will... Play Finesse. 
So, so far everything has been free. Demon form seems pretty good right now. I have a lot of exhaust synergy. Or I can just kill this guy. And what do I get back? Double tap, probably. I can get two things back. Let's get double tap. Oh no, I could just get one thing. Now I can defend or I can use two powers. Actually, I can dual wield Feel No Pain. And you know what? I'll play two Feel No Pains. Holy shit, wait, what is this? Whenever you play a power, gain three strength? Uh-oh. Uh... Okay... So let's... Play Offering. No, let's play... He's gonna gain strength when I do this! I have to play Infernal Blade, right? I have to play Offering. So whenever I play a power, he gains strength. I have to play Panache. It's too good to not, not use. And then... I'll double tap. I'll play Seeing Red just so I can get more draw. Oh no, I double tap! Oh wait, no. I didn't... I don't even know. Let's try and kill this guy here. So strike. Twin strike. So he's dead. Clash. Clash. And turn. I'll block all his damage. He's doing 45 damage. I need to block. Pommel strike for card draw. Finesse for more block. Applying weak sounds really good right now. That's Infernal Blade first. Oh, Body Slam. Deal damage equal to your block. I don't want to play Metallicize. I don't think it's worth it. I'm gonna clothesline him. And then I will Body Slam him. So he's gonna hit me. Kinda hard. But I think I'll be okay. Let's disarm him. Really important. I'll shrug it off for card draw. No. Is he vulnerable still? I will shrug it off. I'll bash him. And I'll play Anger. Okay. Oh, it would be really nice if we could beat the boss in our first run. Is In Flame worth it? I don't think so, man. You know what? Defend. Headbutt. Cleave. Cleave. That's all I'll do. Here, finesse, headbutt. I'll take back my finesse, shrug it off, finesse, twin strike. He's gonna hit me for 39. I guess I defend. Shit! This isn't looking good! I have to demon form. I need that strength. And then we just go into turtle mode, right? We just defend as much as we can. And turn. 
I take nine damage. Uh, he's whittling me. He's whittling me away. What do I do? Is he vulnerable? I bash. I finesse. I drop kick. I can't kill him. I second wind and I exhaust my cards and I gain a butt load. I pommel strike him. I can't do anything else, but at least I'm not dead, so I needed that defense. God damn it. Can I kill him this turn? Please. 42 damage is all I need. I think I can do it. Double tap. Is he still vulnerable? He's not. But I can clash him twice. What's happening? He's not dead? What do I do? Holy shit! Oh... Oh no. There is nothing I can do. He's gonna hit me for 40. Do I have card draw in here? If he's vulnerable, gain one card. Do I have anything that causes vulnerability? No. Okay, I guess I have to finesse and hope I get lucky. Second wind. A headbutt. I tried to put... Finesse back on my... I exhaust? Do I get a card draw? I don't! I'm so fucking dead. No! No! I think I'm dead! Ah! I was so close! Okay, well I gotta unlock. I mean, for our first run, I would say that was pretty successful. I unlocked a few cards. Limit Break, Spot Weakness, Heavy Blade. I unlocked a new character, the Silent. And that's that. Unfortunately, we weren't able to beat the boss on our first run, but I think we got pretty damn close. Hopefully next time we'll, ex we'll enjoy just as much success, but that's the end of this episode. Thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this run. Um, next time we'll probably run as a new character, but if you enjoyed this episode, as always, you can leave a like and subscribe to my channel for more updates in the future. Otherwise, keep in touch, guys. I'll see you guys next time. See you soon.